This is just a short video from Tulla Maths on the key information for the upcoming Leaving Cert Maths exam 2024, such as paper layout, the structure, timing and exam technique in preparation. Paper 1 takes place this Friday, 7th of June at 2pm and Paper 2 takes place on the Monday, the 10th of June at 9.30am. Both papers two and a half hours in length. The structure is the same for Paper 1 and Paper 2. Both papers have two sections, a section A and a section B. Section A, there are six questions and you answer any five, each question worth 30 marks. Section B, four questions, answer any three, each question worth 50 marks. Paper one is worth 300 marks in total. Paper two is worth 300 marks in total as well. This is just suggested timing, might help some people. So at the start of the exam, take maybe about seven minutes to read over the paper, pick the questions you're going to tackle. Allow maybe 15 minutes approximately for a 30 mark question. So these are section A and about 20 minutes for a section B 50 mark question. That leaves about eight minutes at the end of the paper to check back over, check for those small little slips. These are just some exam preparation techniques to be aware of. Use blue or black pen only. Don't use any other colors and avoid using pencils unless for sketching only. More than likely, no marks for writing down a formula. So just make sure and fill something into the formula. Again, don't do any calculations in your head. Leave that for another day. Use your calculator. Don't rub anything out, just put a line through it that you can still read it in case there may be marks for it. Be careful when rounding, question might ask to round to one decimal or two decimals, so just be aware of that. Show all of your work, whatever you do on your calculator, make sure you put it on paper. Show workings to constructions, make sure and draw all of your arcs. Don't leave blanks, put something down, make an educated guess at it. Keep an eye on your time, put your watch on your desk and just time yourself for every question. Sometimes easier questions have more marks than those more difficult parts. Advice would be to go through last year's marking scheme on education.ie and just check how the marks are awarded. Give attention to those basics. Underline keywords. Don't overcomplicate a question. Always look for an obvious solution to it. Make sure your calculator is in good working order and clear all settings before you go into your exam. Sketching can be handy and mark information on sketches. If there's diagrams on the exam paper, label them, fill in all the information that you know. The advice there, do not leave early. Something may come to mind that you'd like to go back and check on. So use all the time you have. Don't get bogged down on a particular part. If you're stressed with it, move on and come back to it later on. You won't be penalized more than once for making the same mistake. So if you do a part one, you make a mistake in it, and use it correctly in part two, then marks should be awarded. Make sure to explain your answer if you're asked to give a reason for your answer. Don't try and reinvent the wheel. All questions will be more than likely linked to something you've studied in class or in your log tables. Answer all the part A's and B's firstly and confidently. These are questions that'll build up those solid marks. Look through your log tables, be familiar with what's in them and be aware of where to find the formula that you need. A new set of log tables will be given to you on the day of the exam. Bring your own calculator and mat set. Have everything ready on your desk. Calculator cleared, compass out, pencils out. Don't be waiting for the person to say start and then you go rooting for stuff. There's plenty of paper. You'll have spare paper at the end of your handout. So just make sure you stay with inside the box given or the spare paper um, from the superintendent. Don't be afraid to ask for material from the superintendent. Don't be waiting on someone else to ask. If you need additional paper, make sure and ask. And the key there is staying hydrated. Drink plenty of water, bring your water into the exam. It's a long two and a half hours. And the best of luck to all those Leaving Cert students from Tullamats.